quarter three, week seven. Sources and uses of sound energy. Matatag curriculum. Bansang mga bata, batang mga bansa. With me, Teacher KMT. Good day, kids! Today, we will learn about sources and uses of sound energy. Here are the possible objectives for today's lesson. Number one, explain how sound energy can cause changes such as producing sound in musical instruments or conveying information through communication. Number two, Observe sources of sound energy including musical instruments, electronic devices, and natural sounds in different settings. Short Review Recall what do you know about energy? Very good! We need it to live. Another it gives electricity. Next, because of it, we can work. It is around us. It comes from the sun. And it provides us light. What do you think are the kids doing? How do they communicate with each other? What is sound? How do we use sound to speak and hear? Can you give examples of how animals use sound to communicate? Unlocking Content Area Vocabulary Energy is the ability to do work. This means that energy makes things happen. The sun, as the principal source of energy for the earth, makes other forms of energy possible. Energy transfer is the process of moving energy from place to place or from one object to another, but the form of energy does not change. Sound energy, a form of energy we can hear. It is an energy created when matter vibrates. Vibrations are very fast back and forth movements that you cannot see but can sometimes feel. Explicitation. This explicitation is to be guided by your actual teacher. Work example. Look at the picture. Answer the following questions. Number one, can the students hear each other in the picture? Number two, if you think they can, how does that happen? If you think they cannot, why not? Number three, look at the picture. Are there any signs showing if sounds is moving between the students? Let us read a story. The stuff in our world. Things in our world take up space and have some weight. There are three common types of stuff or matter, solid, 
liquid, and gas. A jacket, chair, and cup are all examples of solids. You cannot put your hand through a solid. If you had microscope eyes, you would see tiny particles in solids are packed together tightly. Water, juice, and oil are all examples of liquids. We can move our hands through liquids like swimming in a pool. Tiny particles in liquids are not packed as tightly as solids so we can move in between them. Two examples of gases are the air that we breathe and helium in birthday balloons. We can also move through gases. Particles in gases are not close together. The spacing of the particles makes sound to travel much faster through a solid than a gas. Lesson Activity this lesson activity is to be guided by your actual teacher. Energy causes changes by making things vibrate. For example, when you play a musical instrument like a guitar, the strings vibrate to produce sound. Similarly, when we talk, our vocal cords vibrate to create sound waves that carry our words to others, allowing us to communicate and share information. Sound waves are vibrations that travel through the air or other mediums to our ears, allowing us to hear. They can vary in pitch, high or low, and volume, loud or soft. Sound travels through a gas. Sound travels through a liquid and sound travels through a solid. Sound travels fastest through solids because the molecules are packed closely together, allowing sound waves to move more quickly. Sound cannot travel through empty space where there are no molecules to vibrate. For example, sound travels much faster through steel than through air or water. Sources of Sound Energy Number 1. Musical Instruments Instruments like guitars, drums, and pianos produce sound when they vibrate. Number 2. Animals Animals make sounds to communicate like birds chirping or dogs barking. Number 3. Everyday objects Things like alarm clocks, phones, and cars make sounds. Uses of sound energy Number one, communication. We use sound to talk to each other and share information. Number two, safety. Sirens on emergency vehicles warn us of danger. Number three, entertainment. Music and movies use sound to entertain us. Kids, remember, too much loud noise can hurt your ears and make it hard to hear well. 
It is important to protect your ears by wearing earplugs or keeping the volume down on your devices. Learner's Takeaways This Learner's Takeaways is to be guided by your actual teacher. Evaluating learning Multiple choice Read carefully the questions below Choose the correct answer from the choices below each question Number 1 Which of the following is an example of a source of sound energy? Letter A A light bulb glowing Letter B A stationary car Letter C A glass on a table Letter D a guitar string vibrating. What is the correct answer? Good job! The correct answer is letter D. A guitar string vibrating. Number 2. Sound is made when things letter A. Melt letter B. Vibrate letter C. Freeze or letter D, disappear. What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter B, vibrate. Number 3. We hear sounds because our ears Letter A, catch sound waves Letter B, make light waves Letter C, store energy or letter D, change color. What is the correct answer? Excellent! The correct answer is letter A, catch sound waves. Number 4, which of these is an example of sound energy? Helping us to stay safe on the road. Letter A, a car horn. Letter B, a whisper. Letter C, a clap. Or letter D, a sneeze. What is the correct answer? Great! The correct answer is letter A, a car horn. Number 5. Sound travels fastest through Letter A. Air Letter B. Water Letter C. Jelly Or Letter D. Steel What is the correct answer? Very good! The correct answer is letter D. Steel Two, true or false? Read carefully the statements below. Write true if the statement is true. Otherwise, write false on the blank space before each number. Number 1. Sound travels faster through air than through water. Is it true or false? Good job! False! Number 2. We can use sound energy to communicate with each other. Is it true or false? Very good! True! Number 3. Sound can only travel through solids, not liquids or gases. Is it true or false? Amazing! The correct answer is false.
Number four, musical instruments create sound energy through vibrations. Is it true or false? Great! True! Number 5. Sound energy can be harmful if it is too loud. Is it true or false? Good job! True! Well done, kids! What have we learned today? Today, we'll learn about That sound energy causes changes by making things vibrate. For example, when you play a musical instrument like a guitar, the strings vibrate to produce sound. Similarly, when we talk, our vocal cords vibrate to create sound waves that carry our words to others, allowing us to communicate and share information. We also learned that sound travels fastest through solids because the molecules are packed closely together, allowing sound waves to move more quickly. Sound cannot travel through empty space where there are no molecules to vibrate. For example, sound travels much faster through steel than through air or water. We also discussed the sources of sound energy. Number one, musical instruments. Number two, animals. Number three, everyday objects. We also learn about the uses of sound energy, namely first, communication, second, safety, and third, entertainment. Kids, thank you for listening. I hope you have learned. Please do not forget to click the like, share, and subscribe.